Today's class, we will be talking about a digital light board. Our board has a little bit of analog options and then the digital aspect. So if we come in close, the analog options is kind of like the other board at Maryvale. We can control channels individually. So one through 40, this would be one through 40. And then we turn the knob 41 through 80 and 81 through 120. But then we need all of the other lights. We have almost 400, 500 different channels that we use. So we need to be able to control them. And that's where we have the digital aspect of the keyboard. And we type in each individual channel to control the lights on stage. So I've turned off all the lights. Now we're going to individually control some of the LED lights we have. So our catwalk lights, I know are 100. That's where we put them in channel 100. So we can do channel 101 through 108. Then we go to the right side of our keypad and choose at for what intensity or brightness. And we can choose full, meaning 100%. And then the lights still aren't on, so we have to click enter to control that. Now on stage, our catwalk lights are on. And then on our monitors, you can see the sentence that I created, channel 101 through 108 at full. Let me add on to that and just say 101 through 408, which is our catwalk first, second, and third electric, and our psych lights at full, and then enter. Boom, all of our lights have turned on. So I've said 101 through 408. That doesn't mean there's 408 lights on stage. That is our channel 101 through 108, channel 200, 300, and 400, turning on all of our LED lights. At the bottom of our board, we have green lights turning on and a few blank ones. These are also our submasters. Each one that is green already has some sort of light queued up. So here's one, a second one, third one, with just a bunch of looks. A couple more fancy uh, pieces of a digital board. If you look at the monitors, we have two of them. And the monitors is where traditionally you'd see a bunch more items on the board. So if you look to the left, we have three different tabs, four different tabs up right now and a plus sign. So we're on a live table, which is all the lights, 101 through 107. I can scroll down, I can scroll. I'm just using a mouse like you'd have at home. And you can see all the lights are on FL for full. We have another tab, playback status, which are just the, the light cues that we have used for our previous shows. Another tab I have up, ML control, we'll come back to that for different color options. And this one is show control, and to the right there's a plus sign. So there's almost a good 10 to 20 more options you can do with the digital board. And then we have the two monitors. So if we pull back, I can have the cues on the right side and the lights on the left side whenever we're doing shows, and I can have both options available now let me show you how a digital board can control the different colors of the LED lights. So if we go to our monitor, we're at that ML control tab, like before. I've also pulled up some gel options. So I know they aren't actually gels, but if you were to go look through Roscoe or GAM or Apollo or Lee, all the different gel colors, they have them listed off for us. And as I click one of the colors, you can see the stage will change that color. So I've clicked kind of a red, that is a very bright red. Maybe a yellow and a blue or a green. And that's because they're all changing because I still have 101 through 408 changing to that color. Another option is to go to this color wheel or kind of a color triangle. And all you have to do is click on the triangle what color you'd like. So those are some digital board aspects. We still have plenty of similarities. If we come in close, we still have our master slider or master fader that takes everything out and makes everything go full or to zero. You can also hit the blackout button above that just turns everything off really fast. 
And then if you're ever working a show, the main buttons you'll ever work with are the word go and back. So if a designer or a teacher has planned all the lights, everything's done, the one button you'll ever hit is go, and the next cue for the show happens. Then stage manager says go, next cue. What if we mess up? You hit back and it reverses back a cue, and then we're good, we hit go, and we continue on. Lights, blackout, go.